Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel for Let's Play The Sims 3 Generations Season 2 Part 3, I think. Oh god. Ugh, I'm already forgetting it. That's not a good sign because it's the beginning, girl. Oh. Oof. So if you guys remember in the last part, we had Caden's birthday and it was at the little um, water park right there. And I decided to go ahead and invite out Snuggles. Um, Snuggles Covington for a little, I don't know, get together, like get to know Snuggles. We want to get to know our wife's family, obviously, you know, it's, just, it's not that serious, right? Right. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and talk her just up and down, you know, discuss some work with her and there's an effing deer right here. Oh, she thinks we're hot. That's, that's great. Um, I don't know if. It would be right for us. Okay, you guys. What the? What? Did you guys hear that? Let's go talk to Valerie. Let's go greet her. Let's see if she says sister-in-law. Because I don't want to get with someone that's our sister-in-law, you know? Um, I'm sorry. Like, that would be weird, right? She's our sister-in-law, too. Well, what the hell? All right, you guys. You know what? I got a plan, so hold on. <laughs> Okay, yeah, so I ran into a couple of problems, so don't look at this side of the screen, but look at what's happening right now. Arya Lancaster wants to know if Jack Foreman wants to go on a date. We're getting to accept, so I'm going to fix our little... Why the fuck is Tracy Tanner in our house? I messed up, okay? I clicked add sim. I didn't mean to... BRB. <laughs> Okay, you guys, so it's actually the morning now. I went ahead and just skipped a lot because it was literally, like, <laughs> just too much going on. And we didn't even, like, go on the little date because I was like, he wouldn't do this. Not yet. You know, it's, they just got their house and their babies. Like, can Jax handle being a dad to two toddlers at once? Maybe. Um... I don't know. He's really struggling with just having these two babies. And the babies are hell of a lot easier than the two toddlers. You know? So, like, toddlers need that that care. Like, I know, like, their needs go down faster than toddlers. But in real life, you know what I mean? Like, well, I don't know. Uh, to me, it's, like, the same. I, I'm just saying, okay? he's. I just don't think he's going to be able to handle it personally. So... I don't know. I guess we'll see what happens. Maybe he'll... <laughs> uh, I don't know. But they age up in two days? Oh, no. They age up tomorrow, which I think we'll actually go ahead and age them up today because I want them to age up already. I want to see what they look like. I'm super anxious. I feel like they've been freaking toddlers forever. So let's go ahead and wake up Remy. Amelia. I Amelia, yes. I love her name so much. Amelia May. I love the middle name, May. <laughs> Uh, so we'll go ahead and give her a bottle and snuggle her. And my air conditioner is kicking on right now, you guys. So if it's loud, I'm sorry. But I, girl, I live in Arkansas. I gotta have it. What the? What am I doing? I'm a whole mess. Snuggle her. Uh, put her in the crib, please. And then we'll come down here. Eat. Um, we'll eat some pancakes. Uh, she's waking up. So she'll go ahead and eat some cake. Because I'm not sure how many pancakes we have. And I guess he's... He's riding on his new horse. <laughs> oh my god, he's so cute. I love our little boy. Our little Caden. Oh my god, he's been in this Let's Play for literally ever. <laughs> I feel like, oh my god, since she was a teen. And she has 13 days, so she aged up to an adult, so. Yeah, he does need to age up soon, though. Which age has been five days, so really, uh, that's soon enough for me. Um, I guess he's getting off his... Pony. I think I'm gonna buy him maybe like a. What can I get him? Um, that can go outside. What is it? Is it like spring? Okay, it's fall, but we can still probably get him something to go back outside. Maybe like a tree house or something. That'd be kind of cool. Get the sci fi hideaway. That's something that Zao would buy because his dad's really into science and everything, so. If there's even room, we'll have to delete the tree, but whatever. How is that out of bounds? It's literally not. Oh my effing god. You know what? Forget it. 
we will move eventually, you guys. Like, I this is not a forever home. I love it, but it's not a forever home. Um, it's just a house for right now while we are making enough to pay the bills. And it has enough room for all of our kids. So, yeah, that's kind of what this house is. Um, do we actually have bills to pay? No, but we have mail to get. So, let's go ahead and pick that up. And I totally, by the way, remade Tracy... Tracy Tanner, so I like did, I meant to change her name, but honestly her name is fine. It's not that serious to me, but he needs to come and repair the shower. Uh, so I don't know exactly what kind of drama I want to have yet, but I know I want drama. Jax just got a gift in the mail from Aria. <sighs> the note attached to it reads, I was thinking about you and thought you might like this. Call me. And there's a letter for Valentina from William Green. It says, I've been too shy to say it in person, but I really care about you a lot. Do you feel something for me? Okay, first of all, what the hell? Arya? Arya is out of the park. We gonna find this hoe. How is she just gonna send something in the mail to our mans? Like, you know what? Let's go ask him. Like, do you know about this? Like, what, what is this? And then he'll, like, be like, she, I don't know, man, like, she asked me out on a date last night, like, let's go argue with him. And he'll be like, well, I guess he's got to, he'll fix the shower, but then we come him back. We come up for his ass, okay? Valentina don't take no shit. I'm going to tell you guys this right now. She don't take shit from nobody. Um, not her family, because her family did give her shit. A lot of them did. Um, especially a family that lives in like different areas, you know, they would be talking to um, Gracie, her mom, on the phone, or Grace, Gracie, whatever, on the phone all the time, like, you need to take better care of your kid, like, why is she pregnant in like 16, 17? You know, so she always was catching shit from her family, and she's, she's a grown woman now, she is not dealing with that no more. So we're gonna take care of our babies, we're gonna change her dirty diaper, and then we're gonna... <laughs> Get out of my way, you hoe. Okay, well, he's gonna change her to need diaper and then put her in the crib. And now you, first of all, you ain't going nowhere. You get your ass back here. And then you can come use the bathroom because you do kind of gotta go pee. Um, and then, can you empty that? Awesome, awesome. Okay, let's go ahead and argue with Jax. Be like, just, what is this? And then we'll show him the little thing. Let's put it out. <laughs> we'll put it out here. Oh God, it's big. I thought it was like a little mini one. We'll put it out here and be like, what is this? Wow. Hold on, let me get a picture. <laughs> ah! Pressing the wrong buttons. I gotta press F10, so you guys know it's weird. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and argue with him and be like, what is this? Like, my sister sent you this. Do you guys have something going on? Like, you can't give us someone other than my sister? And he's like, no, I'm not getting with your sister. I'm not getting with anyone except you. And then she's like, where were you last night? Like, you didn't come home till late. And then <laughs> Snuggles is calling him. She's like, who the hell is calling you? He's like, babe, calm down. It's my coworker. Um, so we'll go ahead and talk to Snuggles for a minute. And calm down for a sec. Because she's getting a little out of hand now. Um, so we'll go ahead and change um, Remy's dirty diaper. And put her back in the crib because she's okay now. We need to get out of the house, so I think we'll go ahead and stalk down our sister and fight her. Because we're extremely upset with her. You know, that's crossing the line. Here's Derek, our dad. Where the fuck? You're retired! You're retired. Like, why are you working? Like, I don't... <sighs> Men. <laughs> uh, so where the hell is she? Is this her? That's Valerie. Where the hell is her sister? Valerie and Luke. Well, we're gonna come here anyway and pick these damn flowers because there are some seriously good looking flowers. Actually, you know what, hold on. Let's go here with Kaden. We're gonna drag Kaden around. Kaden is our baby. Like, that is our baby boy. Like, that's my son. <laughs> oh my God, my cat. Hold on, guys, I gotta get a picture of him. I was thinking of my son, because I said my son is going to follow my cat. What the fuck? I'm putting this picture on Twitter. 
Oh my god, this has to go on Twitter. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, he's got his like his head underneath the pillow, not on the pillow. Underneath. Okay. So he is feeling humiliated. Humiliation tends to wear rear its ugly head just behind the heap of insulting comments. So yeah, he is feeling a little bit upset right now because I mean she just come at him like so angry, like what? Excuse me? So, but she had every right to be angry, but while she's out, actually, we're going to go ahead and fight over Tracy. Um, see if she wants to hang out for a bit. We're, we probably won't do anything, but we can go ahead and see if she wants to hang out or anything like that. Um, we'll give the babies um, a bottle, play with them stuff while we wait on her. Hopefully, she actually wants to come here. Um, so, we're going to go ahead and pick all these flowers up and Kaden, 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 Kaden. Why don't you come over here and skate a little bit? We're going to pick up some pumpkins so we can go home and carve them later. Um, or we can actually probably just carve them here. Like, it's super nice outside. What is the temperature? 40. Okay, well, it's pretty freaking cold out. So, honestly, she probably needs to put on some more clothes. And looks like Tracy is coming over. Who the fuck is calling us? Like, seriously. Like, answer our phone. A prank call, maybe? Okay. Yeah, it was just a prank call, so... Nothing important. Uh, who? Oh, it's Austin Formans. Okay, we're, we're not going to that. Or at least she won't. I don't know if he will or not. Maybe he'll take Tracy. I don't know. All right, let's go to put Amelia back in the crib. And then we'll come down here. So this is Tracy now. I gave her, like, a huge, like, literally just redid her whole face because she was not cute so yeah this is her she kind of a hoe ain't nothing wrong with that though you know what i'm saying like you do you boo you do you if you want to be a hoe be a hoe i know i'm stopping you all right let's go ahead and let's go sit next to her okay honestly stop getting all these pumpkins how many do we have okay we have three that's good so we can all have a pumpkin let's go ahead and pick up this indian blanket and we'll pick up this one as well Pick up all these. We need this extra cash because I don't know what's going to happen with this family. So I just want to be sure to have money. But I think um, we might actually go around town and try to meet a few new people. There is someone in particular I want her to meet. So we might actually touch our kid. Oops. What? Oh, yeah. I have him over here. The Westbrook family. Do you guys know who Landon is? <laughs> you guys remember Landon? Landon Westbrook? Ah! I placed him in the town, y'all. That's my big secret. I've been kind of holding the secret. I don't know if you guys remember since literally like season one. Um, it says he's at the pool, but like where he at though? Oh, is he in the hot tub? No? Where the fuck he at? I literally do not see this boy. He's not even taking a poop. It says he's at the pool, but... <laughs> he's not here. Okay. It's at the swimming pool. No, he's not. You liar. Uh, you liar. Okay, well, we're getting cold anyway, so we're just going to reset the slot. His ass going to be home today. Oh, oh. No, he's a food merchant. Okay, well, first of all, no. Advanced. I'm going to show you guys really quick. If you have Enroz, this is how you change their career. You go to basic, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> okay, you don't go to basic. Uh, you go to intermediate, career, choose job, or whatever you want to do. And I don't know what I want him to be. I don't really care right now. Um... He can be in the, he can be in the business career. So yeah, this is Landon Westbrook. Um, if you guys remember him from my Runaway Teen Challenge, he's literally so hot. God, I can't stand it. Okay, cool. And give him a friendly introduction. I need to fix his hair. As you guys can see in this little picture. Like I said, I uninstall a lot of CC, reinstall a lot of CC goes both ways so let's go ahead and just kind of let me cuddle with her a little bit 
Just like a, a slight cuddle. Oh, she accepted. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about this. Can we kiss her? <gasps> don't do it, Jax. Don't do it, Jax. Jax, no! Oh, no. I didn't think she'd accept it. They're not even friends. Uh, they're not even friends. Uh, oh, my God. Okay, well, these two are going to go home because... Freaking God. Ugh. All right. Y'all need to stop making out because they come at home. So we need to not be making out while they come home because I'm not ready for it all to fall apart. All right. Let's um, end the date and ask her to leave. All right. Yeah. You need to skedaddle before my wife gets home because she will actually kill you. What the F? No. Okay, come in here and why don't you serve up some dinner? Look at her. She's actually running. She's like, oh my god. Oh, <gasps> no. You girl, you should have drove. Girl, you should have drove. <sighs> she gonna be some ass. Not today, though. Not today. All right. Why don't you come in here and use the bathroom? Um, we all really need to eat, but uh, we will have to do that. I'm gonna go ahead and give him a... Uh, pumpkin, give him a pumpkin. And let's go ahead and carve a jack o' lantern. He's gonna do a silly one. He'll do a silly one. I love this. I love that. Ooh! Alright, why don't you go here and uh, go ahead and carve another jack o' lantern and we'll carve a ghost. Um, we're gonna actually go to our dad's party. Um, because he is getting old, like, I don't really want to, like, I want to, like, have him stay here and carve a jack-o'-lantern with his kid and wife, but, um, our dad is actually getting old, so we do need to go spend some time with him, uh, regardless of who the hell's there or not, so, and that's fair, I mean, that's extremely fair. Oh, look at the little snow, how beautiful. See, this save is not, well, it was obviously a little bit laggy there, but... The save is not near as laggy as, like, my A's here. Like, that is just insane. Here's Grace. Why don't you go and... Well, I don't want to be a celebrity, so... Who is here? Wade Lancaster. Piper Sparks. Arya Lancaster. Arya freaking Lancaster. Go talk to her. Can we not have you in this outfit, please? Like, uh... Outfit... Every day, please. You looking? Oh, oh, girl. Or that works. Um, let's go ahead and ask her about her career. Ask her about her degree. I don't know. She shouldn't have a degree, but she might. She has a degree. Degree in communication. This how she. We know she bought that. Mm -mm. Let's ask her if she's single and ask her sign. I get to know Arya a little bit more. She is our sister-in-law. Indeed, don't look like that, y'all. Uh, you need to grab a plate and do you eat? No. All right, you need to grab a plate as well. Um, and then we need to come upstairs. Take care of Amelia. We'll uh, give her a bottle, snuggle her, and play with her. She does kind of need the poo-poo. I'm just going to cheat it a little bit just because... I don't want to put her down, get to bed and everything, and then two seconds later, she literally is shitting herself, so. All right, can we be romantic with our sister? Okay, we can, so it must be okay, because it's an in-law, you know? <laughs> I mean, it's not okay, but whatever. Where's our dad? We really came here for our dad. Here's Valerie. Oh, excuse me? Were they flirting? I don't think so. I don't think so. Let's go over here and ask him about his day and um, compliment his home. And we'll give him a compliment on his party as well. Like, this is a good party, Dad. Like, I love you. Bye. <laughs> um, yeah, we're going to go ahead and go home, though, because it is 9 o'clock. And I think he has work tomorrow, don't you? Yeah, he does have work tomorrow, so we do need to go home. Okay, obviously, like, no, just, just no.
Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wrong, wrong interaction. I canceled out there. Go change a dirty diaper and put her in the crib. And we'll go to sleep ourselves. Um, or not. Who else is crying? Oh. Remy's crying now, right? No, no, I lied. Okay. Uh, she's gonna go to sleep. Um, Kaden needs to not be doing that. Uh, he does that way too much. Like, it drives me insane. But he's gonna go to sleep. And I think he should be home any minute. He's gonna go ahead and grab a plate as well. Um, and I'm going to be recording part four with this part as well, you guys. So if you guys do leave any comments or suggestions, I won't be seeing them. Like, for the next part, if that makes any sense. Like, I will see them, but I won't be able to use them until part, like, five. Um, because I do want to go ahead and get a few videos recorded. Because my boyfriend is getting ready to leave for Alaska. So, I'm trying to spend a little bit of time with the boy. Because I'm so sad. This is our first time being apart for... Since we, like, moved in together. And I'm not ready emotionally. <laughs> Physically, <laughs> he's gonna be gone for like literally a week and a half and I'm probably gonna die and I might like actually have to like Get a taxi to work and my whole life's a whole mess Because <laughs> I don't have a car y'all but I'm actually gonna go ahead and end this part here you guys I hope you all enjoyed it. I am recording the next part. You guys should let me know what kind of drama specifically you want with him, um, I do plan on having a little bit more than just one lover. Because we do have a romantic interest now, which they haven't done anything, like, absolutely too crazy. Like, I feel like if he came out to Valentina on what he did with that, or not Valerie, Tracy, they'd be able to fix their relationship. I, it's not right what he did, don't get me wrong, but they would be able to fix it. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed the part, and I will see you all in my very next video. Bye, guys.